Yeah. All right. So let's do a chus for Fushlema for our Jesse over here. Yes. Where is Jesse? He's there? I said, where He's is in the he? hospital. Yeah. He's here. Oh, yeah, the there you are. Jesse, how you doing, Jesse? Not so great. Jesse, so getting out anytime soon? No, they're going to keep me. You're in the psychiatric ward? Shh, don't talk about that. <laughs> they gave they gave him your bed. They said you free, he must be friends with you. <laughs> no, no, I, got, I, I had them build me a room here. It's got mattresses all over. <laughs> you mean the pad? You know, don't have to tell everybody about your padded walls there, Landa. Right, I said mattresses yeah. all over the wall. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, okay, well, you should have a refuel shalema. Amen. So we have to re- so we have to learn start then. So so we have to talk as a refuel shalema. No. Okay, so ready to roll. Um, fine. So to Chaza from yesterday. Uh, uh, what is it? What do we do? What's today? Ta- today is I'm get so mixed up because we we. What's today's daf? Lamed Gimel. Yeah. Okay, so yesterday we is, did Lamed. Is Mincha Pes. earlier tomorrow than normal? Yes, for though yes, Mincha is going to be most. I imagine most shuls will probably daven Mincha around ten minutes earlier. So that means that we're going to daven ten we'll daven minutes up. earlier. <laughs> yeah, we're going to daven at four yeah. o'clock tomorrow. Okay, so then the, what time is going to be do? Uh, time, what time That's are we going to do the daven? So that means the daven. Maybe earlier. should we not have it? Should we just not have it? Uh, we got to do it every week. No, we I can barely make it to Minchan time. We got to do a little bit earlier because if you walk to Shul at the time we finish, it's, uh, if you have a five minute walk, you're not making it in time. Yeah. But nobody's working. We're all going to be home all day. No? All right. It's so a we should definitely time. do it. Hey, should we do the daf in the morning? Uh, well, I'm available. Oh, that's hey, a good idea. Mustafa, you, you're open, Mr. Thomas, tomorrow. No, you're going to work? Me? I am going. Yes, I'm going to work. So Taka, we should do it. Okay, well, I don't know. What does Ayla want to do? I like okay, the idea you know, of going into Shabbos everybody's... with learning. What? I like the idea of going into Shabbos with learning. Yeah, okay. So I'll have to check my schedule. It's not a long time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Gershon, I like going into Shabbos, not fasting either. <laughs> what yeah. do you want to do with the other? Me too. Tomorrow when it's going to be different. When you can do. <laughs> okay, so it's going to be different. It's all. 3.30, yeah? 3.30 tomorrow? Working, sure. Yeah. Okay. Fine, so 3.30. It's not such a long daf tomorrow. Um, yeah, okay. So yesterday's daf was all about tuma. With, with tonight's also, truma. Truma, tuma, kodshim. Right, so how do you measure truma? According to the amount, according to its worth. Meaning if you over on me, on, uh, not true, did I say truma? Me'ila. If you have a Ramayila, so how much do you calculate for whether how much it's worth or they're just the amount that you ate? And we brought proofs, we brought proofs back and forth. Right? And then we said if you eat shruma less than a kazayas, you don't you don't you don't have to pay the, the fifth, the chaimish. And then we had a machlaikas whether it needs to be worth a pruta and a kaza, and it has to be the size of a kazayas like other Yisurim in the Torah or not. And then a papa changed his mind. And then we said Meila is more strict than truma. And that's basically where we're, we're up to. So we went most of the way down of Lamed Gimel Lamed Aleph already, right? Yeah, Lamed Gimel. We went, yeah, so we're more, more than halfway. Omar Mar, around 12, 13 lines up from the bottom. That's where we left off. Who? Oh? Not now. Why? Because. Omar Mar, yeah? We all there? Everybody's muted, huh? No, I'm okay. good. I got it. Yeah, we're good. All right, all right. Just making sure. Making sure. Um, it's almost like the ladies share much of Shabbos. You didn't lose us yet. Yeah, let me you tell, tell you, yet. the ladies share much of Shabbos. Me talking straight for 45, 50 minutes is not an easy thing to do with nobody saying anything. I'm just saying. It's like, whoosh, let no me point. tell you. The questions are only text, only, only and posted. A lot more, and there are a lot more people on that. <laughs> that's that I gotta behave myself too. That's <laughs> 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 okay. So Omar Mar. Yeah. Bamed Truma Right. So we said that when 
is this whole sugya about eating truma that's tamay or not. That's only if the if on Pesach you were mafresh the truma and then it became chametz, right? Havel hifresh chametz truma, but if you take chametz and then you make it into truma, which, which I don't know what kind of crazy person does that because he's got a lot of bigger issues than taking off truma if he has chametz and he's being mafresh truma. But hifresh chametz truma, divrei akol ain't a kedusha. So everybody holds that it's not a kedusha. It, the meaning it doesn't even the truma is not even chal on the chametz. How do you know this? Right? So, because it says you have to give it to the Kayan and not to his fire. Right? So, and if you're going to make, if you're going to give him, um, if you're going to give him Truma, that's, uh, that's Tomei or that's Chomets, so then there's nothing for him to do with, with it. So, that's, it doesn't go under the Pasuk, Titin Loi. Right? Meaning, and even though he can't really benefit from the chametz either when he burns the fire, but that's what you have to do with the chametz, right? So therefore, it's not. It's as if he's not giving the kain anything, so it's meaningless. So Masar Rav Huna the Rav Yeshua ain't tarmin min hatumah You're not supposed to take truma from something that's tummy to tar. Uh, you could see somebody trying to do this. The guy has some some vegetables that became tummy, and he has vegetables that are tar. So he has a good idea. Why should I give the truma from the tar vegetables? Let me give the truma from the tummy vegetables and give it to the kayan. Oh, the kayan can't eat it. Who cares? Not my problem. Right? Again, not going to get the tzaddik of the year award, this guy, but but Lamaisa, it's it's a good idea. Could he give it to the kayan? Yeah. Could the kayan give tummy uh, to, to his behemoths? Probably. No. He can give it to his behemoth. Yeah, he so could give it to his behemoth. So let the coin give, he could give it to his behemoth. Anything. Mm-hmm. No, but, but it doesn't fit under the. Well, that's the Gemara is going to ask. That's the Gemara says. You shouldn't do it. But if you did do it by mistake, then the truma is the truma. Yes, the Gemara says, Why don't you say, Why should that work? Why should it work to give him truma? It says loy, the loy loy right, and you, and you, when you give him truma to mayor, pretty much the only thing he's doing, did I freeze? No, you're good. Now you froze. Muted. Muted. Sorry about that. I don't know what happened there. It's the internet fr- I've changed to a different connection. Looks like it changed you into parrots. <laughs> Why is that? Oh, All parrots was sudden, on the screen. He came on with a serious face. Oh. <laughs> um, then it was Kadai to lose the internet connection to have a serious face for parrots. Um, yeah. Anyways, I'm sorry. So, again, Vim Torah Bishoyge Trumasa Truma. If he does a peshaygig, when he takes truma tameya and he's mafresh it based on truma tahira, it's truma is a truma. Why don't you say it's his and not uh, and an after is or the Gemara says loy kasha. Thank you. Hasam loy seloy shasa kasha. Hacha loy seloy shasa kasha. No, by truma, um, it was there was a time that the truma tameya. There was a time when it was tar. So since it has a shasa kasha. Um, so therefore, it has the ability to become truma. Here, by the chametz, it never had a time that it was kosher, meaning because it was always chametz. So then Gemara is going to ask, well, "Because I mean, how does that work?" So let's see. What does it mean that it didn't have a shasa kosher? Meaning chametz always has a shasa kosher, not chametz. It's wheat, right? When the wheat is growing in the ground, is that chametz? It's not chametz. It's only you have to cut it and then touch it to water. So it did have a shasa kosher. Right? So how do you get um a deloy is a shasa kosher by chametz hechi dami? Kigoyin to achmet with mechuber became chametz when it was attached. Right? You can't take truma when something's attached to the ground. So this thing had to become chametz. Um, 
um, it has to become chametz when it's still attached to the ground. No, but he, this it was isn't the case that hifrish chametz truma. He separated produce that was already chametz. Correct. Which means he did it on Pesach. So on Pesach there was not a shas, there wasn't a shas kosher there. True, but but it did have a shas kosher before that. But but that's not our that's we're not we're not talking about what happened the week before. We're only talking about what's happening today. No, who says it's not produce? But the, the truma tahira truma tame also had a time that it was tara before, right? No. Yeah. I mean, it was, right. It wasn't. It wasn't. Bro- it wasn't created with tummy. Right, because it can't become tummy when it's attached to the ground. That's why. That's why I think the pshat is. So the chametz also. It wasn't chametz. The question is, how does it become chametz when it's attached to the ground? Right. So, so the pshat is is that it becomes chametz once once it grows. And it's no longer, um, it's, it's done. It's almost like on its way out. Sometimes you leave, I don't know, I never saw wheat, so I can't tell you. But uh, sometimes you leave fruits on the tree for too long and it just, they stop taking nourishment and they start rotting. So that's at that point, if it would rain onto the wheat, then it would become chametz. That's why I think they're busy, right? The pictures of the Rebbe's in uh, Arizona, Elio, when, when the Rebbe's go to Arizona? Is he there, Elio? Is he on there? Summer, the summer, no? They do it in the summer, correct? Yeah. I guess no, no. Um, not yes, I mean, because the point is, the why are they cutting it so early? I think because you leave it on there too long and then it rains, then you got a problem. Anyway, so that's the case. But I'm sorry, I was the Gemara asked. But if it became comments when it's detached, no. Then that it's also kidsha. Armale in, so he says yes. Yeah, it, that's uh um yes, that's that is the pshat. That if we, if the taka became chametz when it was detached, then it's gonna become truma because it had a shasa kaisha, right? Because he says, Bigzeris Irin Piskamun with my condition shall um she lost it. This is what Nusuf Svart says by uh Kigavna. Do they say something like this in Kigavna? Pardon my ignorance. Anybody diving to Svart here? Friday night? Anybody know what I'm talking about? No? They definitely they yes, say yes, I, right yes. You have to, you know, I, I, I haven't said Kagavna in years because I don't dive in, in the Svart uh, place does, does now. This, is there episode Lushan like this in there or I'm not just... Uh, I'm going to look it up. I don't know. Whatever. It's not so important. I'm totally. It's fine. Anyway, so it's, it means, right here. This is Rashi says it's a, it's a puzzle in Daniel. Right, when Daniel had a had a right. dream, right. right, and uh, that he's gonna have, right. um, so meaning that he had a dream of Malachim coming to him. So Malachim to Midah Chum. So that's what it's saying here. The Xeris Irin. He's saying because he asked him, "Is this true that if the Chumitz, if it only became Chumitz after it got detached from the ground, then then the Truma is gonna be a Truma?" He says, "Yes, that's true." The Xeris Irin his Kama. Right, it's it's uh, um, it's a gzera from malachim, of a maimer kadishin, and it's the maimer of of kadishin, Yeah, that's this this thing is from holy people. V'chein maimer bebe medrasha, and that's the way they paskin in the bismedish, like meaning what what I said, which is that again, if it becomes chametz after it's detached from the ground, then it can become truma. He also rav huna breder rav yeshua. Now we're on tome beis. Um, Omar, he said, Omar Kro, Rashis, it says Rashis, which is the beginning, right? The first thing you have to do, Truma. Shashirah Nikarin Li Yisrael. That the left, Shashirah Nikarin Li Yisrael, there has to be the leftover of what you didn't give is Nikar to Yisrael. Yotzezusha, ain't she? Shashirah Nikarin. Here, it's not Nikar because the rest is Chametz. Meaning, when you're giving Truma, when you're giving Truma, the leftover of what you didn't give truma has to belong to a yid. But if it's chametz, if you separate when it's chametz, then the rest doesn't belong to a yid because nobody's allowed to have it because it's also bahano. Fine. Yosef Ravacha bar Ravavia kameder of Christa v'Yosef Avram v'Shmeder of Yochanan. Anovim shenitmu. Right. So you have grapes that became tummy. So now, how are you gonna? You want to squeeze the grapes, right? Darchan pachas pachas mikabetz. I'm sorry. Can I interrupt? I, I thought this was a continuation. 
we just finished saying that the whole drush of Leivalei Leirei is only when it's mach, uh, it's when it's on the vein. What do you say? I'm sorry. The whole drush of Leivalei Leirei, we have a drush specifically right. only for when it's hechmitz on the on the stalk. Lai for Laila Oirai. That it doesn't work. It's true, it doesn't work. Correct. Right. And then the mascot of the Gemara is it does work if it's if there was a shasa kaisha. It's only it's only talking about when it's attached to the ground, yeah. A drasha yeah. for that case. It come out not in the gaya. Um yeah, I guess so. I wow. guess so. Yeah, that's uh, and, uh, and, uh, and uh, live and learn Gershon. <laughs> yeah. That's what it's comes not, out. It's not a kingavna. No. Okay. It sounds okay. Simil, fim, sim, similar, <laughs> but no. But uh, it's not. No. It sounds similar. It must rhyme. Does yeah. it rhyme at yeah, least? It rhyme, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so there you go. I mean, you could yeah. say it, and no one would know the difference. <laughs> That's true. That's yeah, true. you could stick it in a note, right? <laughs> <laughs> sounds like one of the Friday nights mirrors, you know. It's, all right. it's something along. I know something <laughs> epic like that. That's what. I, <laughs> yeah. Um, Okay, so anyways. Maybe so, I'll see Dasa. So it's a Yosef Ravach Abar Ravavi, Kameder of Chisav, Yosef Amr Shmeder Rechon, and Novim Shinnit, and so grapes never came to me. Darchon Pachas Pachas Mikabetz. So if you, what you do is you step on them and you do less, you let you do, you only squeeze out less than an egg's worth. But Yain and Kosher, then the Sachin. And then the Yain is going to be Kosher, even to be Manasach and on, on the base, on the, on the, uh, on the, Mizbeach, uh, right? Alma, so what do you see? Kasavar Mashkin Mithkat Kidi. What we say is that the Mashkin is is uh it's it's uh, what do you call it? How do you touch it? It's wrapped and wrapped. Contained. Mean? I guess contained, right? It's the ma it's it's basically the point is is that the liquid of a fruit is a separate entity than the fruit itself. And therefore, just because the fruit is tummy doesn't mean that the liquid's tummy. Lay must come to me because why? When is the liquid going to become tummy? Lechich sachet lo. Only once you squeeze it out. Lechich sachet lo. Less in the shiurei. When you squeeze it, it does not have. It does not have the shear, right? Because if you do it less, the, the oh, we should have said this before. Anything less than an egg's worth, anything less than a kaveya cannot become tummy, right? So basically, you have a grape that's tummy. You want to you you want to save the the grape juice or the wine out of it. So what you do is you squeeze out only an egg's worth, right? So that can't become tummy. So even though now the grape is tummy, the the juice will not become tummy, and therefore you save it, right? So obviously he's holding that the, the liquid is separate. What? The kabei of the juice or kabei of the fruit? I thought the juice, but even though it's kabei is That's not really. Think, yeah. It's, it's not, not really. really uh, how did the grape become tummy if you need to convey it to become tummy? I get no, the grape can, can be bigger than a, a, a grape can be bigger than a kebe, I guess. I mean, then they have the grapes and it's sold quite large, no? Well, I think, but uh, you're right, you're right. It's a, it's a pretty, pretty large grape, yeah. Unless you, don't, you say you don't say like barrier by a grape, like even if it's whole, even if it's less than a kebe. Yeah. That's for that, the bracha. What for brachas? I don't know. Is that a din and toma that something that's whole could also become tummy? I not that I know of. No, it has to be. It has to be size of a bit. Maybe I don't, I don't think so, but I don't know. For brachas, we yeah, say that. It's not, but it's not one grape. Tummy. It's grapes. It's great. It's what well, you see. You're saying a cluster it doesn't have to be one grape. You're saying a cluster has to be the size of an egg or each no, grape. I'm just saying you're squeezing out the amount of grapes of a kabeya. But I'm saying it's why is it one grape? I thought each grape would have to get its own its own status, no? I know that's what I thought. Uh, not if not if a whole box of grapes became tummy mace or something. Mace I mean, we're saying on of him. Why is it? I'm just saying. Why would we think it's one? No, oh, each grape has its own thing, no? No. Wow. When you squeeze out the grapes, right? It says lu lesser the shiure. When you squeeze it out, there's no shear. When you squeeze the grapes. Yeah. Because he took three grapes at a time instead of three bunches at a time. I understood it that the grapes themselves are less than a the kebeya. So therefore. If it's right? one at a time? 
That's why I thought it was. I, I don't know. I, I, I don't. Unfortunately, I don't know the. I don't know. I have enough experience in learning these things. Lashon doesn't look like that, though. I hear. Okay, maybe. Um. I mean, Rashi says the aim bezagin kebei a litein tuma the apachas me kebei to darach. He always he's crushed less than a kebei. Okay, I don't know. It has to be one grade. Why are you saying? Because so then what's the case? He takes forty five grapes and has enough juice for kebei. What the, what the, what kind of case is that? That's no, so he would have to take he would have to take a smaller amount of grapes, I guess. No. Yeah. Um, okay, I don't know. E either way, you got to make sure you get less than that. Whichever way, the cluster or the grape itself, you got to make sure you do less than a kebe. Right? So that's a that's a way of getting uh, getting out the grape juice, even though the grape itself is tummy. So then Gemara says, Ihochi kebe tsunami. If that's the case, then you should do it even with an egg too. Right? Even if the grape is an egg size, the tanan, tummy, mesha, sochat, zeisim, vanovim. If somebody, a tummy mace, decides to squeeze out the grapes, right? If it's exactly the size of a baya, it's tar. So you see that you're allowed to mean because when you when it's exactly the size of the baya, then when it gets squeezed out, it's automatically less than a kabeya. So why are you saying it has to be less than a kabeya? Just say it's a kabeya. Just say a kabeya. Right there, it's de avar. Here it's lechatchila. Very interesting, right? When you see D-E of it, right? Everything, B-D-E-V-A, b e v a right? It's one word. Here it's spelled a two word. This is what it is. It's D-E of it, right? If you did it, right? But here it's the What's your Aaronstein's famous joke? What's that? A little bit the Evid. This joke, Moshe's. A little. A little bit the Evid. Very good, very good, right? So, because it's a, we're afraid that you're gonna end up doing more than a kebeah, right? We could hear that. So, I'm a little who's listening to you and to Rabbi Yochan on your Rebbe. I mean, that's some way of disagreeing, right? Where did Tumma go? <laughs> right? You have the grape is Tommy, all of a sudden, you're squeezing it out, Tumma's gone, right? Where did it go? Alma Kasavar Mashkin. So obviously he holds Mashkin Mivla. Guys, 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 guys. He's Zev. Sorry. Alma Kasavar Mashkin Mivla Bli. You see that he holds that the liquid is absorbed in the grape and it's part of it. For human to itmule ochla itmule mashkin. Since the food became tummy, meaning the the eichel part, the how do you call it? The flesh. The flesh? The meat, the meat of the grape, okay. the meat of the grape. So, so to the liquid, there it does. Armaleivat like Tizbra, the mashkin mifkut fidi. So they said back to him, and you don't hold that the liquid um, is mifkut fidi. It's it's just what do you call it? Contained, right in there. Vatanan tummy meish shasachat zeis and vanovim. If you have a tummy meish who's squeezing out olives and grapes, mechuvenes kebeya. If it's exactly the size of a beya, tahirin. Right, um, and that's going to be tar. So, how you get? How do you get that to be tar? Again, a guy who's tummy mace is is stepping on grapes and olives, and the, and it's going to be tar. What comes out? If you say that it's just contained in there, it's not part of the grape. That's why it's tar. But if you say that it's absorbed in it, am I tahirin? So then, why is it? So why should it be tar? It's all about grapes that never became hoksha to be makabal tuma. Right? So what happens? Laimus mishashri, when does it become kosher? Right? Remember, we said that all fruits cannot become tummy unless the first has liquid on it. Right? So laimus mishashri, when is it going to become kosher to be makabal tuma? That's when you squeezed it. Kisagalu, batalushi, or when you squeezed it, since it was an egg, size of an egg, so it's automatically less than a shear. And therefore, it's not going to become tummy. Do you like Tema Achi? Because if you don't say this, Had the Tanya, Halamaz says, I'm a little too much to sim, Zaysim Vanovim, or you or some, you know, God is the Zaysim. What is it similar to to giving Truma on strawberries and grapes that became tummy? Shainly, but Loi Hatarachilo, Loi Hatarasaka, and grapes because they have liquid in it, 
There's nothing for a coin to do, right? We had this a couple of times. There's nothing for a coin to do if you give him truma that's tummy, that's made out of grapes and berries. Because you can't you can't eat it. He can't eat it, the coin, and he can't use it for firewood either, because there's so much liquid and it's gonna put out the fire. Right? So Shain, so it says that this Shain Libo Lohatarachil, Lohatarasaka, Ho Heterachila Nami is bay. You could have a heterachila di by Dorachlu, Pachas Pachas Mikabe. Why can't you just squeeze the grapes less than an egg? And the berries less than an egg, and then the coin could eat it because it's not going to become tummy. Right? So, so that's what that was his kind of that. So you see clearly that it's not, it's not considered mifkot pocket, and it's considered part of the grape. That's that's on the other ways you have no understanding that someone no our Rabbi, no Rabbi says no, really it's not part of the grape. But Kizera Dilma Asibuli de Takala. We're afraid that it's gonna to come to a takala. Right? Why? Like we said before, yeah, because you're going to end up, you're going to end up, uh, well, we didn't say it before, really, but the pastus is, what, what's the takala that's going to come out of it? You'll end up eating the grapes, right? It's going to end up eating the grapes, right? If you're going to allow a guy who has tummy grapes and you allow him to squeeze it, so then it's going to become, you're going to end up, you might end up eating the grapes. So therefore we say, don't, don't do it. So I'm going to buy him. We had this a couple of blood ago. Are we chayshid? That somebody is going to mess something up. You're allowed to light a fire with bread and shemen of truma that became tummy. Right? So you see that you're allowed to use truma tamea. Right? Oh, why don't we be chayshu that you might eat the bread or chayshu that you might use the oil? The bread you throw in between the wood, so it makes it disgusting. Shemen shal truma, rami lebe klimas, and the shemen of truma you put into a klimas. I don't understand something. Isn't that a bazillion for bread? How do you take the bread? We, didn't we have Gemaras already? We had it in Brochus for sure. That you're not allowed to throw bread. You're not allowed to be mavaza bread. Even the halach is that's not so posh to throw out bread. And here it's saying you take the bread and you throw it amongst the wood. So it, act, it purposely makes it disgusting. Right? So that you can, nobody will end up eating it. Unless maybe it's a special thing you're allowed to do because it's shumah tamea. What do you say? Is the point to make is the point to make it disgusting or to make a hacker? In other words, oil, there's no way you can make a hacker. So the only thing you can do is make it disgusting. Ah, you put it nicely between the firewood. See, I know it's firewood. There's no way I'm going there to take a bite. Every time I go, I'm not gonna make a mistake. I mean, right? I mean, it says it says moss, and Rashi says moss. Bottom the Rashi on the bottom line says pas zorikle mimisa. You're not gonna come to eat it. Gershin. Especially when you're running a grill and you put some and you put some buns on the grill, you eat them. And if it falls off, and so you take off the ash and you <laughs> eat it again, Vita. You don't listen. You don't throw it away. There's always those guys that you're asking your gosh and rush in a fire and eat the hot dog anyways, right? That's why yeah, yeah. you, know, you got those guys that the marshmallow falls into the fire or the hot dog <laughs> falls in the fire and they still eat it. I'm one of those. I'm one of okay. those. You know? <laughs> I hear. It. I don't know. But I guess that, that's that's my care from this whole Gemara. That's my care from this whole Gemara. Then. It's not even most then. Yeah. So I had a cash on this Gemara, Baruch Hashem, right before the daf. Um, it's it's in Yonah de Yoyma Shtikel, right? So Lamaisa, so what's with the leftover? I'm sorry to go back to this, but what's the, with the leftover oil from the Hanukkah Menorah? Right? Why can't you save the oil for next year? Mr. Brewer brings the tour, and he brings the tour. That says you cannot save your left oil or leftover oil for the menorah because you are um, because you're we're afraid you're going to use it. Okay, so put into a clean moss like the Gemara here says. Mishabura says no, that doesn't work. Tor says it doesn't work. Does that right? true for those prepackaged gel ones? What are you saying? Uh, the prepackaged gel mirrors, is that true? Or is, I mean, there's no nobody's using that for anything. Right, so lechayra, lechayra, that's not a, that's, you're right, you're right. So I don't know what you do with the prepackaged gel. But the standard oil, what do you do with this, right? Here the Gemara is clearly saying by truma, you're allowed to let it stay, and you can use it in the fire, right? Because it's moss. So how come by Ner Hanukkah? So I look, Baruch Hashem, the Drisha asks this kasha from the Gemara, Psachim, Lama Gimel, Lama Beis. My mom has just found it, right? In Hilchas Hanukkah. 
right before, right before, mamash a minute before, the mamash asked from this Gemara, he says, what's, why, why by Truma are we allowing it, and by, and by uh, Menorah we're not allowing it, not only problem is, I can't remember what his Teretz was, <laughs> um, what was his Teretz? I th- he said, I think he said because the shaman from the oil were less bottle from it, something like that. We're less, we're less separated from it than the truma. The truma like that, it's disgusting and you're not going to, you made it into truma, so it's less of a chashash that you're going to use it. But the manoira is more of a chashash, something like that. Some, along those lines is the tarot. So anyways, it's the drisha on the bottom of the tour um, as this kasha. Fine. Okay, so the bottom line is, is that you are allowed to leave the, the Shemin. Fine. Okay, so let's divide. The Gufa, it's about six lines up from the bottom. Gufa, Madlikin Bepasu B'Shemin Shal Truma Shenitmes. Right, we said you're allowed to light with the bread and Shemin of Truma that became Tommy. Abay Amr Shmei Techizgi, Avarav Amr Devei Rab Yitzchok Bar Marsa, Amr Av Huna, Loi Shano El Pas. This is only by bread, Avachiti, but wheat. So if you had wheat, that became Tommy. Because perhaps you're going to come to, to uh, Takala. Right? So wheat we're worried about. But even chitim you're allowed to use to burn. To burn. I'm like, why don't we be chashed that you might come to a Takala and use the wheat? So our answer is Kedamar of Ashi. Back on now we're on Tom Ral of Kedamar Ashi. It's talking about where you shliksa is you boiled it up, right? You boiled up the wheat, and then umeista, and then you made it moss by throwing it with the wood. So here too, also only when you made it disgusting. So meaning enachanami wheat, you would not be able to hold on to make firewood if it's tame, it's truma tame. But if you make it disgusting, then it's allowed because there's no chashash takola, right? So, where do Ravashi say his din about Shlikto Meista? Ahod, Amar Rav Avin, Bar Rav Achav, Amar Rav Yitzhak, Abashol, Gaval Shalbeis Rebbe Haya. Abashol, he was the uh, the gov- the Gaval, the the guy that made the he was like the, the guy that made the dough. The but, kneader. Uh, the kneader. The K N, right? K N, right? Yeah, kneader. He was the kneader. Now, uh, by the way, I was just the, what? The K N ninety five. There you go, right. So, but Abishol is quoted in Shas a lot, right? So, does this mean that he was the baker or he was just being Mishamish Rebbe? I mean, because clearly he was a very learned fellow, right? So, I don't know. Abishol, Gabal Shobes Rebbe, he was the needer. Now, we know, we know all the food, right? Rebbe had tons and tons of food, so that must have been a big job to do this. So, he was the, the needer of, of Rebbe's house. And they would heat him up, um, fire with truma tamea, so that he would be able, and then he would use the dough on that fire, and it's going to be still tar. Right? Now, one second. Uh, who cares if it's tar? He's not a Kayan, Rebbe. Rebbe wasn't a Kayan. Now, by the way, it's also not Truma. Well, I guess it is Truma. What, what's, what's he doing with Truma Tamea? Yeah, so the shot is, Taisvis, they, they, they would buy it off the Kahanim for cheap. Right? And then they would use it. They can't eat it. So they're using it for the fire. So, so he would, and it would, again, he would take the wheat, buy it, buy it cheap off the Kahanim, which is also interesting because Rebbe was from the wealthiest Jews. Right, but they bought the stuff. They bought right, He's, and they bought the wheat from the kayan. They used it for the fire, and it's everything still still stayed tar. So again, they would heat up the fire with wheat from chuma to 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 knead the dough betahara because Rebbe ate api api tahara even though he wasn't a kayan or anything like that. So what it says, yeah. yeah. I have a note here from the last time. Yeah. The Toysvis Rid says in the time of Rebbe, they, they, had, they still had the offer of the power of Duma. So he was able to retire it. Is that so? That's what I have a note. And that says Toysvis Rid. I, 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 wow. Wow. That's, that's quite interesting. I hear. Very good. So that's what it says. Why are we afraid that, that they're going to come to Takala? 
somebody's going to end up using it or eating this. So Ravashi Ravashi said it's talking about where they cooked it and they made it disgusting. So so too that's here too by our That's what it means. The shlik the meister. Fine. Now we go on to something else with with truma with truma. Abaya bar Avin ver Chanani bar Avin tanu trumas be Rabba. They would learn the sechta trumas in uh, in Rabba's yeshiva. Pagavu Rabba bar Masna. So Rabba bar Masna met them. Amar lehu mayam rusa betruma de beimar. What are they saying about truma in your yeshiva? Right. You know, a couple bachram come home ben asmanim. And somebody asked him, Do what did he say about Truma in your yeshiva? Amrulay, who my kashalach. So they said to him, What's your question? Amrulahu, so he said to them, Tanan, we learned over there, Shasile Truma. Truma, Shanit Muva So if you have um, plants, just Shasil is a plant of Truma that became Tomei, and then you put them back in the ground. So now what's the status? Because things that attach to the ground can't become Tomei. So again, you have, let's say, uh, uh, you have wheat that became Tomei. Then you go, and it was truma. And then you go and you plant it in the ground. So to hirem militame, it's they they're tar from militame anything else, right? Um, now meaning when you when it grows more, and then you gather it the second time. So therefore, it's not going to be able to be militame anything. But asura milacho, but you're not allowed to eat it. So it can't make other things tummy, but it itself can't be eaten. If it's tar from being matam anything else, why is it also to eat? Right? Doesn't mean that it's also to the Koyim. It means it's also for Yisraelim. Right? It's also for Yisraelim. Right? Meaning so because it still, it still has a truma, meaning it's not tummy. But it's truma still, so a kain could eat it. Right? So the habamino was that a kain can't eat it, and now the gemara is saying no, that a kain, a kain could eat it. But my kamashulon, the gemara says, what's it teaching us? Gidule truma, truma. That things that grow grow from truma is truma. Tanina, we learned gidule truma, truma. Things that grow from truma still remain truma, right? But that's a bit the rabbanon, right? Um, Rashi says it's the rabbanon. Meaning deraisa when you take truma. You put it back into the ground, it loses its truma status. But the Midrabon, it does have truma. And if you say that it's growth that comes from growth, what's the chiddish with something that the, the seed doesn't doesn't uh, go away? Meaning, normally, when you plant, again, I'm no, I'm no, uh, I don't even know, I'm no farmer, right? But normally, when you plant vegetables, whatever it is, the original thing that you planted, gets lost it gets broken up and that's where the new seeds come from but you could sometimes have things right that does uh that that does uh retain its original vegetable right so that thing um is gonna is gonna stay truma so hanami tanit if that's the case we also learned that a tevel gidula gidula mutarin tevel anything that grows from tevel it's mutter now what does that mean if it grows from tevel Tevel, it's how can you be Tevel is be mutter. So we know that Tevel can be eaten arai, right? Meaning you're allowed to your vegetables until vegetables until you until you put them in the you gather them and put them in the pile. They don't they're they're allowed to be eaten on a temporary basis, not on a permanent basis. So that's a say. So here they would still be considered Tevel from the original time it was planted. So Tevel gedula mutar. I'm sorry that it's not considered Tevel. But that's only with something that its seed no longer exists. But something where the seed still exists. Even if you take Tevel and replant it, replant it, everything is going to be also Bachila. So Ishtiku, so they're basically saying that it was, what's the Chiddush? So he said Ishtiku, they were quiet. They didn't have, they didn't have Pshat. So so they, they said back to him, me you I mean you're asking us. We came back from Yeshiva and you're asking all these things. Did you hear anything about it? Rashesha says it's also the Kehanim Oh, a new thing. The reason why when you replant it, it's still also the Kehanim because it becomes possible with Hesachadas. Hesachadas means that you uh you gave up on it, meaning once the Kayan 
The Kayan has to keep watch on the Truma. We had this a bunch of a lot ago. I think we had it at the end of the first parrot. Right? The Kayan has to keep watch on his Truma, and if he doesn't, it becomes a Suffolk Tumma. How do we know that something didn't become Tommy there? Right? Oh, Mama, it fits in with your tweet to send out about keeping the mitzvahs in your head. Oh, right, yeah, you can't, you're not supposed to be Masir Das from, from, yeah. from that. So the Kehanim, right, so the, I guess we could add that on to uh, <laughs> another mitzvah to me, this, that, that for a Kayan not to be Masir Das from his Truma, but there he has to actually watch it. He's got to more put it on the lock and key, right? So whatever it is, so since it's possible, so therefore, um, that's why it's, the Kayan can't eat it. So the Gemara says, honey, so haguf havi. This goes according to the mandal that says Hesachadas is a psul in the truma itself, in the goof of the truma shopping. Then it works. El mandal Hesachadas psul tuma havi, but according to the mandal it says that Hesachadas is a psul. It's tuma just like anything else, right? Meaning psul goof means we don't know what the status of this thing is because we have no idea. Since the kain stopped watching it, we have no idea did it become tummy or not. So we're saying that it's. That it's a psula goof, there's a psul about it, but it doesn't necessarily mean it's tummy. That's one way of looking at it. Or we could say, no, it's tummy, because the guy was Masih Das, the coin was Masih Das. We look at this thing that it became tummy. Right? So again, honey hesachadas psul ha goof havi, then shop it, and then it's good. hesachadas psul tuma havi that we look at it, it's like mamash tuma, my ikalameimar. What are you gonna say? Right? The itmar. Why? Because Hesachadas, because we what's the machlai? Because it my Hesachadas, Rabyakan and our Psal Tumah. Rabyakan says that it's a Psal Tumah. Right? Because it's very possible that it's Tumah. Rabbi Shimon Lakasham Psalah Guvavi. He says it's just, um, it's it's a Psal from Truma, not so much because of of Tumah. Rabyakan and our Psal Tumah Havi, Shim Yavi, Eli Yavi Terenu. Meaning, what's, so what's the difference in which way it's Tumah? What's the difference? Bottom line is you can't eat it. So Rabbi Yochanan says, "No, Psul Tomahavi." And if Elio Anavi comes via Tarenu, Shaimin Loi, we're going to listen to him because he's going to say, "Hey, it's 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 Tar. It was a Suffolk, and now it's Tar, right?" Rabbi Shimon Ben Lakasha, meaning meaning the Elio Anavi is coming and telling us that your Suffolk is no longer a Suffolk; it's Tar. Rabbi Shimon Ben Lakasha, Psul Haguf Havi. It's a Psul Haguf, meaning it's Truma that's Puzzle. Shim Yovei Elio via Tarenu. Ain Shaimin Loi. If Elio Anavi comes. And says it's tar. We're not going to listen to him because something went wrong with this truma. I Meaning, it's not a din and tuma. Tuma Eliyahu could come and tell us it's no longer tummy because the, even though the kain didn't watch it, but nothing tummy touched it. Fine, but if you say that it's a problem with the truma, so then Eliyahu can't come and make things that were truma, not truma. The apostle truma make it kosher. He only comes for. I mean, he comes for lots of things, but it's not for. Uh, it is not for, the, for this child, it's not going to be so. Ain't Shamila, we're not going to listen to him, right? So that's the that's the Shaila. So now, Acer of Yachan and Rishlokish. Now we go back and forth between Rabbi Yachan and Rishlokish. Acer of Yachan and Rishlokish, Rabbi Shmuel, Benoish, Rabbi Yachan and Baraika Aimer, Lul Katan, Hoya Ben Kevish and Mizbech. So there was a little opening, a little hole in the floor between the Kevish and the Mizbech, right? We know the way the big Mizbech, Mizbech Achitza looked, right? Had a huge uh, ramp. And then it got, it went out, there was the square. So in that corner there, in that nook, I guess, they had a little hole on the western side of the ramp. That they would put the psulim of any bird that was meant for a chatos that became possible, they would just put it into this hole. And they would wait for its tzura to pass, meaning it's, a tzura means its form. They would make its form pass, meaning weren't sure if it was possible, right? Um, or they knew it was possible, but they wanted to make sure it became vade possible. So it's possible belina, right? Anything that stays overnight becomes possible. So they, to be safe that this thing was possible, they would put it into this hole. The yards in the base of and then the next day, then they would take it to the base of Srefa. So to, to be burned because it was vade possible. I mean, they didn't want to burn it unless it, it, they knew without a question it was possible. So if you leave it overnight, so for sure it's possible. Right, so, so if you say that is a psal tuma, mishum hachi by ibur tzura, so that's why he needs ibur tzura. You want it to wait overnight, because shem yove el yove tarana. Maybe el yove is going to come and say the thing that you thought was tame is really tar, and then you burned it for no reason, right? Ela iyan amri psal haguf, 
But if you say it's a psula guf, lama lady burtsura, why do you need to wait overnight? Right? Vatanan, zakla, we said this is the rule. Yeah? Kol shepsule begufa, yisar of miyad. Anything that becomes possible with the guf, right? Meaning the a classic example is pigle. If the kayan has in his head that he's not eating this, this carbon in the right time, so it's going to be possible. So that's you burn it right away. The dama of violin, but if it's something goes wrong, that's if something goes wrong with the actual carbon. If something goes wrong with the blood or with the owners, let's say the owner was not right to bring the carbon, to Ubar Tsurasan, then we would let it wait. The yards on the base of and then it goes out to the base of Sreifa. So that's his kasha. So if you're saying that this truma becomes, is a psal in the guf, so then what are, what are they waiting for? So Amalei, not, I mean, the kachim here too, so we're comparing the kachim to the truma. So Amalei, hai tana tana devei rabbi barabu. This tana is tana devei rabbi vua. The Amar, afilu pigle tan ibertsura. He holds, no, he holds even pigle, every carbon, you want it to wait overnight. So it vadai needs to be put, then it's a vadai psul, and that's why you're going to burn it. Right? So therefore, it does, there's no kasha from that it's a psul haguf. Okay, we're still in the middle of a shtickle of sugi here, but we'll, we'll stop over here and we'll finish tomorrow before, uh, before uh, Shabbos. So 3.30 tomorrow. Rabbi, this has to do with our learning in the morning too. We're talking about uh, the guf being nene from the guy's malacha. The guf versus... Uh, uh-huh. I, yeah. Get, yeah, so... All right. Question. Yes. Questions. Is any of this mouse thing, anything related to mouse or and more importantly, any halacha, that's bad, but any more, more importantly, um, any halachas for Tisha, for our Sabbateris, we need to keep in mind, except fasting until uh, Kiddush? Nope. There's not, there's no, no vino mal candle tomorrow. All right, not in the um, morning? In the morning, yeah. In the morning, yeah. No one, no by mincha. Yeah, um, your showering is even those that don't shower normally on a fast or take haircuts or shave should shave and take haircuts. Brushing teeth is an interesting one. A lot of people brush their teeth before Shabbos, so they're asking, should they, Can they brush their teeth? Um, Yaakov, I just missed that point. What did you say about shaving? Is it an issue? Some some people, uh, the Mishnah Bruder brings in the Sharatin that a Baal Nefesh should not take haircuts on a fast day. Does not apply and shower doesn't apply to tomorrow because the covered Shabbos is uh, covered Shabbos is more important. Uh, okay. um, but the brushing the teeth with covered Shabbos, I mean, I told people they could do it, but I, I'm wondering if that's uh, if that's the right thing. And all the COVIDs out there should not fast if you're not feeling well, right? Jesse, I'm assuming, uh, and uh, even Dovi, those that just got over Dovi, Dovi, you're not, you know, you're looking a little schmach. I don't know how you feel. Yeah, yeah, it's still slightly schwach. You schwach so tomorrow around fast. five fifteen. <laughs> yeah. you you slightly schwach, don't fast. Yeah, we're all going. We're all going to Dovi's house. Tell me. And Avi, you too, Avi. Somebody <laughs> told me I should ask you. He what? just told you don't fast. <laughs> I, I, I heard. I felt weird unless you're in shape. Unless you're in shape enough to do a kazatska tomorrow. If you could do that, then maybe, maybe you should I fast. Not doing you no kazatska make it, tomorrow. <laughs> What what do you say? <laughs> and no, because that's gonna be but he can have yeah. a cigar, right? All right? Cigar for sure. Good night, everybody. Yeah. Jesse, feel good. Thanks. What do you think? Go. I said, have you seen Rup- his Rup- face Rup- ever? Rup- Rup- yeah. Oh, could they bench Mazuman? The three of oh. them can hurry on a zoom. They... On a zoom. <laughs> yeah, can they bench Mazuman? <laughs> yeah, do me a favor. For those that are not fasting at 3 30 tomorrow, don't have a coffee. <laughs> All right. Mike, I don't know about you. Don't, don't be drinking the coffee on the Zoom. I'll, I'll try not to. All right. Mike, how about you? Fuck. You feeling okay? Baruch Hashem. Thank you. I don't, I'm beginning to think that you can catch Corona through Zoom, what's going on on this uh, daf. <laughs> well, who else was there? Jesse? Avi. 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 I just got you? over it. I have you. I just and, got over uh, it. Dovi Langer. Ben, Dovi you Langer, have it. Ben Yaman, you have it? Today's, now, day, right now. today's day 10 of symptoms. You serious? Sheesh. Yeah. Oh, wow. Crazy. Wow. I'm the... Uh... And, you know, we're the slowest daf. Some of us had this back in April. <laughs> <laughs> Some of us tried do- not to get it. We just... Uh... 
how many other shiurim you have people with COVID come to learn? Is it Bikir Hashem? Huh? It's true. That's true, Taka. It's true. See that? I'm sure the other people, shiurim, I don't know. Without <laughs> masks. Without <laughs> masks. We have people who move to Israel without, and, and did the daf. Yeah. Yeah. Enthusiasm is contagious. It's a... Uh, <laughs> Testament to the uh, to the mag, mag, mag awesome. yeah. Are we gonna I saw an ad today for somebody who's running a Zoom thing. Called, the company's called Gam Zoom Lataiva. Did you see that? No, that the, one of the Agudas is doing something. Epis, I saw it in the Ated. So the, the thing running it is Gam Zoom Lataiva. <laughs> that's that's <laughs> bad. There you are, doctor. If you're saying that's <laughs> bad, then it must be pretty. You know what? <laughs> you know what's sad is I'm surprised it took so long for one of these Jewish things to come up with that. Oh, they, okay. One Listen. second, but didn't he say that as Rebbe Zrachi's brother? Yes. Yeah. Then I posted it, Siakov, no? Oh, that's what he said? Yeah, yeah. Gamzum yeah. Lataiva. No, he said, he, no, no, no. He said, he said, Gamzum Lataiva. Oh, right. That's very good. Very good. <laughs> uh, Rabbi, can my, can my daughter put makeup on tomorrow? 100%. Or Shabbos? 100%. COVID, anything for COVID Shabbos is allowed. But even on a regular fast, you're allowed to. What did you toast there, Rabbi The question is, can you put no, on? You, oh, that's what you asked about making up the fast. No, you yeah. don't know. You're putter. You're putter. The only fast that maybe, maybe somebody has to make up is Tainus Esther because there wasn't a Kavua Dika time during the Adar to do it. But every other fast, if you're, if you're, what do you call it? I heard, I heard, don't I worry, don't worry. Binyamin, is, you are, don't Binyamin, you're good to go. You don't have to make it up at a later time. I, I thought sure. this fast is one of the most humorous fasts. How early can I make Kiddush tomorrow? Yeah, that's a good question. Uh, listen, yeah, 40, 41 minutes after Shkia, 515 in New York, you're, you're for sure okay. Um, Weitzel said 512, I think. Not before. Not yeah, I'm ready to make Kiddush now. Slackers. Slackers. Yeah, really Zarek, I said the fast ends at 520. And Shayosha says 540, probably. <laughs> oh, yeah. um, that could be. That could be. The truth oh, is, it's not push it. It's not push it why you can't make an early Shabbos and end the fast. There are sheetas, there are sheetas that you could do that, really. Good night. I got my wife's having a panic attack. I got to go. All right. Zarek's on. Good night. Good night. Good night. <laughs> Put yourself on mute. Um, why they say this fast is the most chumr, chumr fast? What are the chumr fast? Well, because it could be on Shabbos. Yeah, and all that. exactly. This yeah, whole but thing. that's not. Uh... It's not really in practicality. Correct. It's I wanted a four fast, but no. But Listen, they're saying because it could happen on Shabbos, it should be more machmer. Blah 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 blah. blah. But it sounds. Darche like says. says five twenty, and Shosh says five twenty three. Exactly. Told you. I just looked it up. Um, so yes, has got. Uh, and Rabbi, what do you hold? Uh, Rabbi holds four forty-five. I personally, personally, wouldn't like would like to eat not before five twenty-three. Wow. Myself. So 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 in your blood. blood. You see that? I hope it's not. But all right. Maybe um, Yonah tomorrow's at five twenty. What's at five twenty? Second Rabbi Yona is at 520. I'm looking at the Luach Zmanim. Zmanim.com. So what, what, yeah, anyway, right. what's, the, what, what's the Lush you're using? And Zmanim.com. And Zmanim.com. I'm sorry, at Luach Zman Hayam, Zmanim Hayam, which is one of those halachic charts. I'm just looking at it now. It says that uh, there's three times a list. There's Rabbi Yona, Rabbi Yona number two, and it says five twenty. I'm just pointing. You can do whatever you want, but um, that's what it says. Rabbi said five twenty three. No, I didn't uh, say that. I said for myself. But if yeah, I have uh, to make kids, uh, Naftali, if I have yeah. to make kids for my family and they want to eat at five fifteen, I'm making kiddush at five fifteen. Okay. All right. That's the that's the deal. I'm saying Shiosh, it says man that they gave out fast ends. It said five twenty three. Okay, I don't know why Shayosh is being so machmer. That's they never go with that shit. Uh, our friend uh, uh, had a conversation with the Rashiva a few years ago, and they started moving back things. Okay, they never forty two minutes is the maximum. Yeah, yeah my's money no, is five eighteen. My's money is five eighteen. 
Interesting. So my, I think so Shkia is at 4.33. Shkia is at 4.33. of 36 minutes is 5.18. The Chazanish is 5.22. I hear. Maybe 5.22. 